Hello viewers, welcome to my channel PMCE. In this video, we are going to see subtraction concepts, properties and keywords. We are in class 2 now and this is the first video with respect to subtraction in class 2. So, in this video, we will have a thorough revision of all the concepts of subtraction that you have learnt in class 1. We will also be seeing the keywords which are important to remember with respect to subtraction. We know that subtraction is one of the mathematical operations on numbers. Let us begin this session by first understanding what is subtraction. Subtraction is one of the four basic mathematical operations on numbers. To subtract means to take away from a group or group of things. What happens when you subtract? When we subtract, the number of things in the original group will reduce or become less. The symbol used to represent subtraction is a simple minus sign. So, let us go to the details of this video to see each and every concept of subtraction that you have learnt in class 1. Now here in class 2 as a revision with sufficient examples. First, let us begin with subtract using objects. You had 10 pencils with you. You give away 2 pencils to your friend. So, how many pencils you have now? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So, you have 8 pencils remaining with you. Now, how do you represent this in the form of numbers? 10 minus 2. That is, you had 10 pencils with you. You give away two pencils to your friend. The remaining number of pencils with you is 8. The answer in the subtraction is called as difference. So 10 minus 2 is equal to 8. So difference between the two numbers is 8. The next concept we are going to see is subtract by crossing out. Here subtract 9 minus 5. We know that this is called as vertical subtraction. Let us represent the number 9 in the form of 9 lines. Now we have to subtract 9 minus 5. So we are going to cross out 5 lines. When you cross out 5 lines, what is the remaining number of lines we have now? 1, 2, 3, 4. So the answer for 9 minus 5 is equal to 4. Let us do one more example to revise this concept again. 7 minus 2. Represent 7 in the form of 7 lines. Now we have to subtract 2. So cross out 2 lines. What is the remaining number of lines? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So the answer for 7 minus 2 is equal to 5. The next topic that we are going to see is Subtraction using number line. This is a number line with numbers from 0 to 20. In this now, we are going to subtract 12 minus 6. I am sure you must be knowing the concept of number line. So first, locate the number 12 in the number line. So number 12 is over here. Circle it. Now we have to subtract. With subtraction means you are going to move in the backward direction. For addition using number line, we moved in the forward direction. Now as it is subtraction, we have to subtract 12 minus 6. We are going to jump 6 times in the backward direction. So let us jump from 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So when you jump 6 times in the backward direction, you arrive at the number 6. So subtraction of 12 minus 6 will give you the answer 6. The next topic that we are going to see is subtraction by counting backward. So here we are going to subtract 68 minus 5. How will you count backward? Have 68 in the mind and 5 in the fingers. So it is counting backwards means we have to count the before numbers. So 68 minus 5. 68 in the mind, 5 in the fingers. Before 68, 67, 66, 
63. So the answer is 63. Dear viewers, if you remember, for addition, we counted in the forward direction. That is, we would have counted after 68 in the case of addition. Since it is subtraction, we are doing counting backward and counting the before numbers. Let us do another example. 73 minus 2. 73 in the mind, 2 in the fingers. Before 73, it is 72, 71. So the answer is 71. Subtracting two digit numbers is the next concept that you are going to revise. Dear viewers, as we have seen each of these topics in detail in class 1, I am quickly revising these concepts here because once you are thorough with these concepts, then you can go into the higher concept of subtraction in class 2. So this video is very important for the children. So please watch the entire video and make sure that the children are very clear with these concepts because we will be learning higher concept of subtraction in class 2. Now we are going to subtract two digit numbers 49 minus 22. So begin the subtraction from the ones place. So 9 in the mind and 2 in the fingers. So it is counting in the backward direction. So before 9 it is 8, 7. Next move on to the ones place. You have 4 minus 2. 4 in the mind, 2 in the fingers. Before 4, 3, 2. So the subtraction of the two digit numbers 49 minus 22 will give you the answer 27. The next topic that we are going to see is properties of subtraction. You must have learned about the properties of subtraction in class 1. Let us quickly revise that here. 8 minus 0 is equal to dash. What is the answer? What happens when you subtract? 0 from any number. You get the same number. This is one of the properties of subtraction. So 8 minus 0 will give you 8. This is similar to your properties of addition. When you add 0 to any number, you get the same number. Similarly, in subtraction also, when you subtract 0 from any number, you get the same number. So 8 minus 0 is 8. The next property that we are going to revise is 4 minus 4. What happens when you subtract the number from itself? So here it is 4 minus 4. The answer that you will get is 0. It is very simple. You have 4 pencils with you. You give away all the 4 pencils to your brother or sister. So what will be remaining with you? Nothing. Nothing or empty is called as zero. So when you subtract a number from itself, you will get the answer to be zero. This is also one of the important properties of subtraction. This is a new property that you will be learning in class 2. The order in which the numbers are subtracted is very important. For example, here we have 9 minus 5. Is it same as 5 minus 9? Let us see. 9 minus 5 is 4. But 5 minus 9 is not 4. Which means that 9 minus 5 is not equal to 5 minus 9. That is why we say that the order in which the numbers are subtracted is very important. And this is an important property of subtraction. In addition, you would have seen that the order in which the numbers are added does not matter because when you add two numbers in any order, you get the same answer but in subtraction it is not the case. The order in which the numbers are subtracted is important and they are not equal to each other. Dear viewers, we are going to see some of the important keywords which is used in subtraction. It is very important for the children to know these keywords because when they deal with word problems, it will be easy for them to identify if the problem is an addition, subtraction or a multiplication or a division sum. So first, let us see what are the keywords. When you see the word give away or take away, you can understand that the problem is related to subtraction. The answer that you get in subtraction is called as the remaining or 
difference. The other keywords that you have to remember are how many are left, how many more, how many less and how many did not. When you see such terms in a sum, we can clearly understand that it is a subtraction problem. Dear viewers, let us see what are all the learning outcome in class 2 for the children under the topic subtraction. First, concept properties and keywords of subtraction is the first topic that the children will be learning in class 2. Next, it will be subtracting two digit numbers with regrouping of the tens. Next, subtract and check using addition. Subtracting three digit numbers without a regrouping. Subtracting three digit numbers with regrouping of tens. Subtracting three digit numbers with regrouping of hundreds and tens. Then story sums, mental math and subtraction worksheet. These are all the topics that the children will be learning in class 2. That is the reason in the first video I have covered the entire concept of subtraction that the children would have learnt in class 1, the properties and important keywords. In my upcoming videos, I will be dealing with each of these topics separately and links to all the related videos will be given below in the description box for your quick and easy access. Thank you for watching my video. If you like the content, give a thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel and click on the bell button to get regular notifications of all my upcoming videos on subtraction. Thank you and see you again.